Will we ever tire of buddy cop movies? Well, not as long as we get the right buddies. Two Guns stars Denzel Washington and Mark Wahlberg as unknowing undercover agents who can't seem to figure out if they're supposed to be investigating each other or working together, and what happens when their world starts to fall apart. Okay, right off the bat, wow, are Washington and Wahlberg good together. I'm thinking I must be a sucker for a good buddy cop movie pairing because I remember saying so many of these same things about McCarthy and Bullock in The Heat, but man, who would have guessed that these two guys would play so well off of each other? You know what it is? And I'll go ahead and call this my best thing about the movie. It's the charisma. Both of these actors just have that certain something that you look at the screen and just want to watch everything they do and then put them together, it's just magic. When they're trading lines and barbs, this movie locks into this incredible energy. It just pulses from the screen. Amazingly enough, if I had to pick one of them over the other, I think I'd actually take Wahlberg on this one. The way he plays this character is full of confidence, humor, and kind of that knowing naivete. It's really kind of brilliant, even though the story itself is kind of basic and well-worn. With these two guys taking us through it, it never feels dull or slow. In addition, I also thought some of the way the plot machinations were presented in Two Guns was just different enough to catch my attention and give it some extra life as well. The wonderful repartee of Wahlberg, Asa uh, wait, Washburg, Wallington, Mark Zell, I'm not sure, whatever. Point being, even as much as they clicked, there's still something about this movie that didn't just quite jive for me. Primarily, and I'll call it the worst thing here, it's really kind of shallow. There isn't a lot of meat underneath here. Now, I don't necessarily need every movie to be a steak dinner, but I would like something more than an empty plate. Part of that may be due to the violence that peppers the film that you may have heard about. Now, I hear the word gratuitous thrown a lot for movies, but here it really feels apropos. So much of the graphic bloodshed and gunplay seem completely unnecessary and added to that feeling of pointlessness that's underneath the endeavor. I also wasn't sold on Bill Paxton's acting choices uh, in his performances, which just kind of felt a little too much scenery chewing and too little truth. But at the end of the day, even those things didn't keep me from being extremely entertained by two guns. For Denzel Washington and Mark Wahlberg's chemistry alone, this movie easily deserves its B. For more reviews, you can check out yourmoviefriend.com or join the conversation at Your Movie Friend's Facebook page. And as always, feel free to subscribe at YouTube to be notified as soon as new reviews are available. Just click that subscribe button right now.